Yo, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to another video. If you're looking for modded accounts, modded outfits, cash drop and shark cards, you name it, Digizani has it. With super fast, reliable services, with cheap prices, I urge you to go to the top link in the description right now. Digizani has the best prices. Use code REBEL for 5% discount at checkout. If you do not own black joggers, I'm going to put a link down below in the description on how to get black joggers. Okay, guys, so go to any clothing store on the map, go to the top section, go to vest and purchase this black vest. Purchase this one back out, go to vest shirts and purchase the black band vest shirt. It is called the black band vest shirt. It's basically an all black vest this one purchase this one back out from the counter open up your interaction menu go to inventory go to body armors and go to show armor and put on the super light armor back out from the interaction menu and make your way over to the shoe section once you are at the shoe section go to the skate shoes and once you had skate shoes, go all the way down and purchase the all great skate shoes. Purchase these. These match the body armor. It looks really amazing. So after you've done that, make your way over to the accessories. And go to gloves and purchase the black leather gloves. Once you purchase that, make your way over to the mask store. Once you do arrive at the mask store, you will need to go to the section called headscarves. Yes, go to headscarves. Continue to scroll all the way down and purchase a dark pattern scarf. It is the same color as the vest. So once you do find it, basically you just want to save this as an outfit and continue to stay at the mask store. Purchase the dark pattern wrap and save this as an outfit. And move over to the left side of the mask store where these hats are on top of the shelves. Push right on the d-pad. Go to bulletproof helmets and purchase... The charcoal bulletproof. Purchase this one back out from the mask store. Apply the saved outfit we just made. And make your way over to the pier. Because there's a telescope over there. So we could do the telescope glitch. Alright guys. So once you do arrive at the telescope. It's very very simple. So all you want to do is run past the telescope. Push right on the D-pad. Pull away from the telescope. And your mask should disappear off your character like this. Open up your interaction menu. Go to style. Go to accessories, cycle through the helmets till you find the gray helmet we purchased at the mask store. Back out from the interaction menu and walk away from the telescope and your outfit should look like this. Bam. Now on this next part guys, make your way over to the mask store and save this as an outfit. And you should have this gray tryhard outfit. Remember guys, hit that subscribe button and let's not waste any more time. Let's get on to the second outfit try hard tutorial okay guys for the second outfit tutorial you will need black joggers as well i'm gonna put the link down below so guys make your way to any clothing store on the map they all have the same items just a different building so once you're there you will need to go to the top section go to vest and once you're on vest purchase the black vest purchase this one after that you go to vest shirts and purchase the white band vest shirt. Purchase this one back out from the top section. Open up your interaction menu. Go to inventory. Go to body armor. And go to show armor. And put it on standard armor. It should be a black one. After you've done that. Make your way over to the shoe section. Once you're there guys. Go to the sports shoes. And purchase all white sports shoes. It's going to make the outfit look really amazing. It matches the outfit. So purchase the all white sport shoes. Purchase these. Once you've done that guys. Make your way over to the accessories. Go to gloves. You will need to purchase black leather gloves. Purchase these because this makes the outfit look really amazing. Once you purchase those. Make your way over to the mask store. So guys. Once you do arrive at the mask store. Go to the crime section. Once you're there, you will need to purchase the black bigness t-shirt mask. Purchase this one. Save this as an outfit one time. Continue to stay at the mask store. Move over to the left where these hats are on top of the shelves. 
And this next part, guys, go to the bulletproof helmets and purchase the black bulletproof helmet. It is called the black bulletproof helmet. After you've done that, back out from the mask store, apply the saved outfit we just made. Now make your way over to the pier because there's a telescope. So we could do a telescope glitch. The telescope glitch is very simple, guys. All you want to do is basically run past the telescope, push right on the D-pad, pull away from the telescope, and that's when your mask should disappear like this. Open up your interaction menu, go to style, go to accessories, cycle through the helmets till you find the black bulletproof helmet, back out from the interaction menu and walk away from the telescope and your outfit should look like this. Once it does look like that, basically make your way over to the mask store and save this as an outfit one time. For this next part guys, you would need a terabyte. If you do not have a terabyte, you can always tell your friend to request his terabyte. You can register as CEO or MC, it doesn't matter. So once you do request your terabyte, enter your terabyte, go to this touchscreen device right here, push right on the D-pad, go to client jobs, and start up the robbery in progress. Remember, you could do this solo, you don't even need a friend. So start up robbery in progress, launch it, confirm it, and basically guys, all you need to do on this part is locate where the duffel bag is. And it doesn't matter which bank it is, the duffel bag glitch will still work. And if you do die during the mission, it's fine, the glitch will still work. So basically, all you want to do is just locate where the duffel bag is and make your way over to the bank. Once you do arrive at the bank, there will be two police cop cars, a juggernaut with a minigun and two robbers inside of the bank. So guys, be very careful, kill off the police officers, kill off the juggernaut, and make your way inside of the bank. That's where the duffel bag is. Remember, if you do die during the mission, it's fine. The glitch will still work. So guys, make your way inside of the bank, kill off the two robbers inside of the bank, pick up the black duffel bag, and make sure you have a flying vehicle for this part, guys. It doesn't matter which flying vehicle you have, as long as it's a flying vehicle so once you do pick up the black duffel bag basically with your flying vehicle make your way over to the yellow drop off point so guys with your flying vehicle all you want to do is fly really high near the yellow drop off point and you will need to jump out of your flying vehicle so once you do jump out of your flying vehicle all you want to do is just open up your parachute and basically glide into the yellow drop off point. So try to land directly into it. If you do not land directly into the yellow drop off point, it's fine, just try to land near it. And once you do land into the yellow drop off point, your black duffel bag should disappear like this. Once it does disappear like this, just make your way to the closest ammunition store. It doesn't matter which one you go to, just make your way to the closest one. So guys, once you do make your way to the ammunition store, basically go inside of the ammunition store, go to the front counter, go to the parachute, and you will need to go to the parachute bags, and you will need to scroll all the way down till you find the Israel chute bag. It is a blue and white one with the star. It is called the Israel chute bag. After you find that, purchase it back out from the counter, equip it on through the interaction menu, and make your way over to the mass store with a flying vehicle once again. All right, so with your flying vehicle, make your way over to the mass store, fly like pretty high in the air, and you will need to jump out of your flying vehicle like this. Jump out of your flying vehicle, and you will need to open up your parachute. Once you do open up your parachute, basically you want to glide into the mass store. So all you want to do is tumble into the mass store and once he falls completely into the mass door, continue to spam right on the D-pad till the mass store opens up for you like this. Once it does open up for you, save this as an outfit at least one time, back out from the mass store, walk away from the mass store at least 10 or 15 feet and apply the saved outfit we just made and your black duffel bag should appear like this. Bam. If you're wondering on how to change your outfit or like trying to enter the store or try to like go inside of stores and it doesn't let you, basically guys, just easy way out, your black duffel bag should disappear and you can change your outfit and you can enter stores again. 
and if you do want your black duffel bag on your outfit like this again basically just open up your interaction menu go to style and apply the saved outfit with the black duffel bag and your black duffel bag should appear again remember guys to hit that subscribe button turn on the bell notification give this video a thumbs up subscribe if you're new comment below what you think about this two glitch try hard outfit tutorial if y'all guys want more joggers or any color jogger tutorials comment below i will start making them and also guys i'm gonna put a link down below on how to join my discord and yeah guys hopefully i did enjoy it. use the code rebel to get five percent discount on those cheap modded accounts i recommend doing it guys but yeah guys hopefully i did enjoy catch you on the next gta 5 online video peace